Bye. <laughs>
they did put an arrow that lines up with the notch so we just line our arrow up with one of the two pins put it back together and we're right there bits if it don't fit give it a little twist pops right on just like the old velocity style so that's the RDA so here we have the top assembly this is the tank section of the RDTA if you look on the bottom here you see the, the two milled out holes this is to allow liquid to leave the tank and go to the RDTA build deck this ring here that spins freely is going to be our plunger system push it down it will cause a vacuum that pushes the liquid through the nozzles on the RDA deck and keeps our wicking nice and moist we have a standard 510 style drip tip on top it's not been lubricated so it's a little bit tough and if I'm gonna hold this down so we can see a little bit better you unscrew here this piece comes off the plunger comes off and inside you see all of the magic these are the balls that cause the spring and on the bottom side cause the vacuum you also see a plug that we will remove for a top filled tank so why the need for a plug this plug is completely sealing the tank to make it completely leak free as long as the two halves are screwed together so this is an anti-leak top fill tank everything goes back together nice and easy simple and we're right back at it inside here you can see the two milled out channels that directs the liquid directly to the holes it's going to escape from so we're going to put this all back together and then I'll get a build in it so guys as easy as we took it apart we're going to put it back together we'll just take this chuff cap off leaving the chimney screw exposed our two holes that are going to line up with the two holes on the tank very simple to use and there we go let's get a build in here and see how she vapes alright guys we got us a nice little Clapton build I put in there real quick this has been a very easy deck to build on with those nice big post holes we built with uh, dead wire stainless steel competition grade wire that looks pretty good get us some uh, some of that cotton candy wicks get her in there we're gonna get her juiced up we'll see how she vapes okay guys we're all built up we're wicked with that cotton candy wicks we're going to get her nice and moist with some vape crusaders e-liquid vanish 414 a nice strawberry blueberry blended liquid we're gonna start this off using just the RDA portion of the RDTA get her nice and moist I can already tell you this thing's gonna blow some clouds that delicious smell from the Vanish 414 I do know something that I haven't mentioned yet if you look on the inside of the RDA part portion it's hard to see um, there are side chimneys those are actually the air inlets the air comes in it's gonna go straight down underneath the coil pull back up through the chimney can you see that 
I'll get a better still picture and I'll put it in there for you guys. So, let's see if we can get this lined up here. As I told you before, we got the little side post, the little pins. We've got our arrow. I'm going to try to get everything lined up here. Look at that, first try. See how she blows. Very nice draw. So the RDA portion is absolutely fantastic. We're going to get the top on. Okay, so we're going to convert the RDA into the RDTA by removing the chef cap. We've got the 510 chimney connector there. She's all screwed together. We're going, I find it easier to pull this down so I can get a hold of it. Just unscrew the top here. Take this off. I'm going to use my tweezers to pull this plug. Plug pulled. You have a nice little hole there to fill. Dropper fits in there very nicely. It's not really small like most of the uh, top fills that we're used to here in the United States. We'll go ahead and fill this completely full because I know I'm going to vape all of this vanish 414. So we're full. I can't tip it over and show it to you, but I got to plug that hole back up. So I've got my plug. Just insert it in the hole. Give her a nice little push. And now we are completely leak free. What do you know about that? Now we put our plunger back on. We're going to screw this top assembly on. And we're ready to go, guys. So we're going to use our plunger to supply e liquid to the wick, to the coil on the bottom. They call it free refueling. Let's give her some hits, see how she goes. Getting a little dry. You can actually see little air bubbles. Tip. So we know the liquid's going in there. Very, very wet wick there. That is very nice. I think I'm in love. We're going to come back. We're going to talk specifics. We'll give you recommendations. And we'll go from there. Let's talk specifics here. What we have is the Gragas RDTA. The RDA build deck. Tank on top. Plunger system to dispense your liquid to the coils. We have an overall height from the base to the tip 51 millimeters an outside diameter of 25 millimeters we're gonna hold four milliliters of juice we have a top fill anti-leak tank with a top airflow system above the coils that pulls down under the coils and back up through the chimney they have free refueling meaning we're really just using the RDA the tank is just storage for our liquid that we are dispensing to the coils on our own. 
comes the build deck, has a post hole. Measuring in at 2.1 millimeters tall, 3 millimeters wide. This RDTA will go up to 300 watts. This is available at be right here www.omirvape.com you can also purchase it directly from my good friend Tobias Vape I'll throw his link up there directly on Facebook he also has Skype that you can get a hold of him purchase these directly this is an amazing amazing device guys I would highly highly recommend that you guys check this out get this in your local shop this thing is gonna sell like crazy as always if you like our review go on down there hit that subscribe button keep your eye out we are also going to review the mini white bone RTA also from Omir vape.com um, amazing amazing product guys I'm going to go vape on this for a while. Hope you guys enjoyed the review. I hope you go and try this. Get a hold of my man, Tobias Vape. Get yourself some of these. Uh, let's get these in the market. I'm Turner Vape for American Vape News and Reviews. And remember, the hotter the candy, the sweeter your vape, guys. Peace.